Okay, so this almost impossibly thin device uh, is called the Plod Note, and it might just be the best AI hardware product to come out of this AI gold rush we've all found ourselves in, but only if you don't factor in the price. And I know that's a big disclaimer, but more on that later. Think of this as a MagSafe wallet that records conversations, meetings, or phone calls and uses artificial intelligence to transcribe those recordings into text with surprisingly useful and accurate summaries. Okay, that might not sound very useful, but for the brain rot millennial like myself or the Gen Zer, being able to record a phone call or a meeting at the press of a button and have all the heavy lifting done for you, that's actually really useful and it's made me a lot less forgetful. So you get this Costco card sized device constructed with metal that's really designed to magnetically attach to the back of your phone and stay there pretty much at all times. It comes with a MagSafe wallet case that does fit the Plod Note perfectly, almost so perfectly that it's hard to remove from the case. But if you don't have an iPhone, it also includes a magnetic ring in the box that you can stick to the back of your Android phone and essentially create that MagSafe experience. So support for both iOS and Android is here, and it's awesome to see. As for the Note itself, it's quite simple. There's a button, a switch for you to switch between recording audio of your surroundings or recording phone calls, and then a little LED indicator light between the A and Plod. All you have to do to record is just long press the button to start recording. You might have to press the button once to kind of wake up the device, but you will see that it's recording uh, via the red LED indicator. And my friends, it does a surprisingly good job picking up conversations. Now, the audio quality is quite poor. I'm going to be brutally honest with you, but it doesn't really matter because the value is in the transcriptions. And this is where the AI comes in. Plod uses ChatGPT 4.0, OpenAI's most advanced AI writing assistant, to transcribe the audio into text with speaker labels and various formatting styles to choose from. There's an accompanying app that will automatically connect and sync up to your note to retrieve the files and start the transcription process. When you have a recording that you would like to transcribe, you can just hit generate and select the template that fits your type of recording the best. It could be a meeting, it could be a speech, a classroom, a lecture recording, a Q&A or a job interview. If there's not one that fits your recording type, you can create your own template with your own prompt describing how you would like to summarize the recording. From there, you can toggle on speaker labels, you can set the correct recording language and even switch between AI models, although there's only ChatGPT 4.0 and Claude 3.5 as of this recording. We might see some more introduced in the coming months though, I'm not sure. Um, and then once it's done doing its thing, you'll get a super accurate, well-summarized and organized transcript, summary, and even a mind map, all of which you can edit after the fact too, in case it like misses a word or something. Now, when it comes to actually recording phone calls, you want to slide the toggle to the phone call recording setting because what it does here is actually really cool. It records the audio through the vibration sensor while it's attached to the back of your phone. So it's quite clever and it works great in my testing. I scheduled an MRI because, I mean, it's no secret I have Crohn's disease, so it's a constant, um, you know, there's constant maintenance, lab exams and everything. Um, and I was on the call for a while and it got all of the important details saved for me so I know exactly how to prep for it and when to show up. And battery life hasn't been a problem whatsoever. I have yet to drain a full battery and can easily record hours of audio without worrying about running out of juice. It gives you a battery indicator in the app uh, and it says that a full charge can record 20 to 30 hours of audio, which I mean, that's probably an, an exaggeration. I think even if it's half that amount, it's still super impressive considering how crazy small and compact this device is. I mean, this thing even has a little haptic engine built in to kind of to vibrate and let you know that it's recording. It's pretty crazy. Now for the not so great part, the cost. It does cost $159, but it comes with 64 gigabytes of memory, so plenty of storage. And that's not actually the bad part. To get the most out of it, it requires a membership that costs $79 at the time of this recording, which gets you 1,200 transcription minutes. You can also buy transcription quotas, they call them, that give you additional minutes starting at 299 for 120 minutes and going up to 6,000 minutes for 89 bucks. So this is not a one and done purchase, unfortunately. The $159 price becomes closer to like 250 bucks with the required membership. However, you do get a free trial of 300 minutes a month with a 30 day return policy. So if it doesn't work out for you, you can return it. 
The other elephant in the room is the voice memo app on your smartphone. So Apple is introducing AI powered audio transcriptions to the voice memos and notes apps with iOS 18. Google also has that functionality available with Gemini on Pixel devices, and it's completely free with similar results as what you'll find here. So just like with other AI hardware products, most of the functionality can be replicated with uh, an app on your smartphone. All in all, I actually really like the Plod Note. Um, I really like the hardware aspect of it. It's way more discreet than recording with a smartphone, and it does bypass a lot of the software restrictions that you'll probably inevitably run into when trying to record a phone call on a smartphone. And let's say you're in like a classroom setting, you wanna record a lecture. You can just hit record, set this down on your desk, and you can still use your phone for other tasks, you know, hopefully productive tasks. You're not, you know, off topic. Uh, but it's nice having like the separate functionality for different devices. For $159, not including the membership fee, it's still a bit of a tough sell though. I mean, there's no getting around that. Um, that said though, I think depending on the type of user you are, if you're a business professional or a student, whether you're recording lectures or attending meetings and you wanna get transcriptions of those meetings, I think that it could be worth it. And it's worth mentioning too that you don't necessarily need a subscription to like record audio, but you know, the, the main functionality and all that's convenient and useful really does require the, the subscription. Plot is not paying me to produce this video. They sent this out for review with no strings attached. Um, and this has been my honest experience using this device to record all sorts of content. And honestly, it didn't suck. So that's a win. If you guys are interested in picking up this device, I'll place links down below in the description. If you guys have any questions or concerns that I did not address, let me know in the comments and maybe consider subscribing. It really helps me out and hopefully I can help you out in a future video if I didn't already help you out with this one. Okay, I'm Bo HD. Thanks for watching. It's good to see you guys. It's been a little while. See ya.